My name is Chichi Umesiaka, and um, I'm a teenage coach. I'm also an AOP with Inspiration FM, and also I've done TV. Which okay, so what are you expecting from today's movie? I just came to watch a movie. Yeah, basically, just to see the movie. And I, I know, you know, from the whole thing, I, I believe it's something that is going to leave a lasting impression on people. I saw um, the, the preview, and uh, it was quite promising. Um, the twist and the turns and then the energy level shows that indeed um, the producers are looking beyond the everyday typical Nollywood movie flicks. I have some friends in the, in the, in the, in the cast and I, and I just want to first of all see them because I want to see um, what my friend Chooks is, has also done with this movie. Um, we've done a lot of things together in terms of has, I won't say upcoming filmmakers, but people who started to film together and it's just nice to see him take this bold step. Um, so I just want to actually come give you support. I think it's more of the support than, than anything else. It's a refreshing um, approach to new cinema. Uh, every time all we just get to see of professionalism is what Kunle Afolanyo does with his movies. Every other movie has been seen to just be there. Uh, yeah, yeah, definitely. Red X has really done well. Um, having to put this together is it easy. Uh, we know the economy. We know what's happening and um, um, seeing that uh, this is a group of young, talented, passion-driven men, it is very, very encouraging and commendable to see them put together this and I am very sure, knowing what is in the parcel and what the organization is about, that there are going to be definitely more of such premieres coming from Red X Studios. Um, considering the fact that it's a new project, you know, I've known I've known Chicks for a while, so I know this is his first major project. You know, I was actually very, very critical. I was looking at the movie sternly, hoping to pick up on mistakes, you know, but I didn't, you know, the the the, the computer scene, you know, where they show the computer hacker, you know, it was spot on, and then where um, the, the scene where they were in the laboratory, you know, doing the, it was just, it was just. It was it was magnificent. I'm I'm I'm, I'm trying to be um, non-partisan now, you know. But it was for 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 a first project, you know. It was I, I don't I don't watch Nigerian movies too much, you know. But for me to be able to give this kind of ratings, you know, then it was. Um, if there's anything I wanted to just look out for in, in the movie, I think it really has to do with the with with, with the with the chasing scenes, the, the running, and all of that stuff. A lot of times we haven't even ca capture that very well in. In, in our film industry, so I, I just I just thought that a good job was done, at least for what I saw in the trailer. So it's nice to actually see that in, in full and see what it looks like. For me, it's all about um, lifting up and bringing new talent up. So almost every person in the movie is fresh, and for me, that's a future. You can't keep recycling old mentalities and old ideas. So for me, the puzzle, it's it's in the future. Mr. James Uem Aka. You are the part of my great family. What do you have to take to take it, man? Think about it. I see you have nine lives, eh? <laughs> Good afternoon. My name is Jebutu Mufaintola Olua. He is a street guy. One of the true kids that actually faced uh, in the streets. And they worked with a cartel boss named uh, The Boss. They always call him The Boss. His name is always protected. And uh, this cartel boss is a kingpin. He knows everybody. He wants to do everything. But, you know, Timmy is a very naive person. The name of the character was Timmy Smalls. So he's a very naive person. He always loved to be on the street and always get people involved. So my role was quite challenging, you know, trying to study the African-American thuggish and street niggerish life on the street. Yeah, my name is Apostle Tuguere. Okay, I did a screenplay for this production, the Paso. Okay, so what would you say has inspired you to do this? Movie? Well, um, when the producer told me of this, told me the story of this movie, I was inspired because there is a lesson in it. It's not a regular um, kind of film. There is a massive lesson to learn from it. When we, every day, as you two are faced with choices, tough choices, and what if that choice comes with you making a, a, a choice that's against your belief system, that's against everything you've been trained to become? How do you do? Shooks is someone that I've known for a while and um, he's someone that really wants to do something that I love doing. I like the storyline, um, I, I like the mannerism of um, the, the actors uh, and also, uh, you know, as Nigerians, we always expect actor not to die for movie. 
you know, and even the actor people not go still die. If it, if it were to be an American movie, the guy will eventually save his mother and perhaps save his sister, you know. But I, at, at least uh, one of the things I've learned from this movie is the lesson yeah. learned. Sometimes movies not all about the action. Sometimes movies not all about. Uh, the, the, the brand that is behind it in terms of act, actors uh, or sometimes the message that yeah, it passes yeah, across yeah. and for me uh, one of the messages I can pick from this movie is like don't do anything illegal because you might not just lose at the end you lose the people that are dear to you yeah. you know and it might be too late that yeah. is if you, if you don't lose your life uh, Shooks the director or the producer should continue to do his best maybe the next movie i'll be the one to be to act the role of james you know or the bad guy uh. mommy mommy hey my daughter how are you doing now thank god no no you're not gay <laughs> just leave me alone you want to be oh just oh, stop it my name is abimbola majolagbe i played agnes in the puzzle um, i'm the mother of james and mercy well, everything is a challenge in life. The most challenging thing about everything is for you to actually put the, the role to play. And in the puzzle, a lot of things came to play actually, because it's quite educative, it's emotional, and it's full of suspense. But it's a movie to watch for every facet. Everybody would definitely take something out of the movie. Yeah, from what I saw, I am looking forward to seeing other stuff. And the, the fact that what I like about it is the fact that the storyline is not the no storyline. It's not the usual that we we are used to. And when I say usual, I'm not saying it in a bad way. But Nollywood is always giving us stories about couples, people in love, people breaking up, and things like that. That's the modern story, the modern Lagos story. But this was this was about young people. It's been a pleasure um, premiering this movie in the puzzle and uh, I want to commend the producer, the director, the cast and crew. They did a fantastic job. Yeah. At least for, for, for a start, yeah. thumbs up to them. Hey, my name is Efe Irele. Um, I played the role of Nena, who is um, the love interest more or less to the guy. So, yeah. Um, I feel like the movie was amazing. The storyline was really creative and thoughtful and um, the production, production-wise, it was a very good job. Big ups to Chooks and Red X Studios. You guys did awesome. Uh, from this movie, uh, really, uh, actually, I'd like to thank uh, Red X for inviting me to come and watch the film. Uh, I was really impressed uh, with the story and uh, really for the genre that the film was made in, because uh, we don't really see films, a lot of films like this. We always see romantic films, but I like uh, what they did. My name is Akin Abi. Say about this movie? Uh, well, I think it's a good initiative from a young guy, and that's why I'm here to support him. I think he really did well to you know, even have a, um, an event that will be you know, fully packed like this. I mean, I was actually very impressed. Technically, um, Chooks and uh, Jake are actually very, 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 very sound technical people. I was very impressed with them. I actually feel that um, they have set a certain bar for people, and I feel that they, they've actually taken a lot of, of risk during this production. I was very impressed with them. And, and I think that if they carry on the same vein, they will actually do fantastic work. Yeah. Well, the movie, like, I, when I came here, I had no expectations, actually. But when I got here, the movie is so good. I did not expect that, you know, a first-time studio, whatever, will be this good. And I'm really impressed. And I would, like, endeavor, everybody should go and see this movie. It's really good. When do I start? What are you doing with that miscreant? Do I look like a baby? Mercy! There's fire on the mountain, man. I mean, what, what did you do with, 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 with the parcel that, 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 that they had to deliver? Oh my God! The boss will stop at nothing until he gets his parcel. Jeez! So I'll ask you a bit gently. Where is my parcel? <laughs>